Okay, ladies and gentlemen, today's video, I'm going out on a limb here. This is going to be ballsy. I'm not uploading a Call of Duty video today. By God, help me. Last time, I did not upload a Call of Duty video. You guys still had my back, and the video almost got like 2,000 likes, or it may have actually gotten 2,000 likes, so you guys are pretty pimping for that. And for this video, I'm going to be brutally honest right now. <laughs> I could have incorporated you guys in this video on Twitter to ask me said questions, but the majority of the time that I ask you guys for questions for a Q&A or a Would You Rather, which is really fun videos to make, I just never make them. Most of the questions you guys ask, Ask, always like in, incorporate like incest bestiality and just like a bunch of nasty stuff like a lot of you guys do that and i have to be advertiser friendly now so what i got here ladies and gentlemen right now we have a give or take simulator boom okay so i haven't made a would you rather video in probably over a year now you guys really used to like this series when i did it i remember i made my first would you rather video probably like right around when i quit my job almost two years ago now what's the date actually in 13 days that's gonna mark my two-year anniversary of quitting my job so that's insane that i'm still able to do this so thank you guys for always watching my videos and stuff you guys have been showing a lot of support lately so i'm very appreciative guys but i mean you guys clicked on the video so would you rather we're gonna get into it so first off we have a would you rather go toe to toe with Michael Myers or try to take down Freddy Krueger? I mean, but for the people that Jesus got, if you don't know who Michael Myers or Freddy Krueger are, good lord. All right, so we got Michael Myers here, who is just like a, a freak of nature, big ass dude that drowned in a lake and he's pissed and he wants to kill everybody. And then we got this skinny little burnt ass who comes at you in your sleep and tries to kill you. So I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take this, this little guy. But if the ultimate, if I had to pick one, I'd go against him and I just keep my ass awake. I just never sleep again, so I don't gotta mess with him, you know. All right, so I'm gonna pick Freddy Krueger and uh. 57% of people picked Michael Myers. Are you kidding me? <laughs> this dude I said, this dude said, I imagine it being the comedian. That's how I picked Michael Myers. And if you guys don't know who Michael Myers, the comedian is, you've never seen Austin Powers, just click off my video right now. Would I rather be allergic to babies or be allergic to elderly people? Jesus, man. I'd go with babies. As much as you guys hate me, I'm just going to go with babies. No, no explanation needed. Let's see what people say. Damn. I'm the 30%. That's bad. Old people aren't adorable. These guys are clever, aren't they? Dude, these comments are actually funny. Would I rather only have a first grade education or live in a world where everyone else only has a first grade education? I'd take the world where everyone only has a first grade education because I'd be the smart. I'd be like the Bill Gates. I'd be balling. That'd be sick. What's this? You see, 69%, ladies and gentlemen. All right, would I rather live until I'm 80 but morbidly obese or live until I'm 50 but have supermodel looks? I want to die looking good. Like, I don't know about you guys, but I'm planning on getting out of here looking fantastic so i'm gonna go with live until i'm 50 but have supermodel looks i'm almost halfway there i'm gonna be 23 years old next month that's terrifying See, a lot of people want to die looking good i feel it live until you're 80 but be morbidly obese i feel like that would be like miserable you know like you wouldn't even be happy but i mean if you're 50 years old and you're looking good you're looking like tom cruise or something you're gonna be getting all the cheeks and you know you're gonna be looking good so you gotta go with the 79 percent here the smart people holy hell would you rather be waterboarded to death or electrocuted to death what the hell would i rather drown or be electrocuted holy hell i'd probably go with electrocution because it'd probably be faster because it'd probably like short out your brain or something just bow you're gone oh we got a smart ass you can't be waterboarded to death that's the whole point of waterboarding because it's a torture method and you don't die from waterboarding let's play the damn game dog all right would you rather be able to read minds but you get a really bad headache after you use it or be able to fly but you're afraid of heights what i mean if you're afraid of heights and you can fly you're gonna fly low to the ground which is lame you can just like drive a what are you gonna be the uber you're gonna be a flying uber for a living like no i'd read minds and invent uber or a different uber or read the guys' mind that made uber and boom. Would you rather not know how to read or not know how to write? I don't write as it is. I type everything I say. So we're going to go with not know how to write. And that's 75%. 1.1 million people agree. Like, oh, God. Right, would I rather lose an eye and a hand or lose a leg and an ear? What? I'd rather lose a leg and an ear. 100%, dog. Yeah, 66%. Okay, okay. All right, if you could only eat one and never eat the other, would you rather eat waffles or eat pancakes? So I'm going to go with waffles because... By God, guys, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you a life hack right now. Some of you guys probably already do this because you guys are beasts. But get a waffle. Go right now. Go to your freezer. Pop a waffle in the toaster oven. Smear some peanut butter on that bad boy and put syrup on it, dude. Peanut butter, syrup, waffles are one of my favorite things to eat on the planet. You can do it with pancakes, too. But I think it's a lot better with waffles. And I, I'm sure everyone agrees. Okay, I lost by a percent. That's understandable. Okay, look how close. That's a tight rate. Would I rather be Aquaman or the Human Torch? I'd rather be Aquaman because I really like like underwater stuff. I think it's really neat, so I'd be Aquaman 100%. Okay, I guess I'm the weird one. I think I might have messed up. Isn't Aquaman like a like a mermaid? Doesn't he have like a lower half that's a fish? I don't know if I'm down for that. Have gravity shut off for one day or have everyone around you go insane and want to kill you? What? I feel like having gravity shut off for one day would be lit. This would be like straight zombie apocalypse. You just get to bust all kinds of caps. Well, that wouldn't be legal. You'd go to jail. Have gravity shut off for one day. What do you mean? Rather commit murder or make the world a trampoline park? 
Well, I guess if you jump and there's no gravity, you're kind of like dip, you're gone forever. This is where bungee cords come into play, ladies and gentlemen. You tie your shit down like a hundred foot bungee cord, just jump and pull yourself down. That'd be lit. If you could be in a Broadway show, would you rather star in Wicked or star in The Lion King? Okay, I don't even know what Wicked is, so Lion King. If anyone picks anything but The Lion King, 204,000 people, no. Right, would I rather be caught at home watching Sex in the City by yourself or be caught in a bar with a pink martini in hand? I don't give a damn which one, dude. I've never drinking a martini, if we're being completely honest, and I've never watched Sex in the City. So, I mean, this is irrelevant, but I guess I'd... If I had to pick one, I maybe I don't want to be that guy at the bar with a pink pink martini, I guess. I think that's a little weird, I guess. I don't know. Would I rather listen to the Macarena for hours straight or listen to Mambo number no. five for hours straight? Okay, I don't know. I know what the Macarena is. I don't know what, what was that? Mambo five? What's Mambo? Not Mambo number no. five. Right. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I know this song. Yo, that song is lit. There, there is no question there that I would listen to Mambo number no. five. No questions asked. But I'd rather cheese grate my upper arm or slide down a fireman pole covered in tacks into a pool of rubbing alcohol. Jesus God. I think I'd rather do the tacks because they'd be like little tiny little babies. And then if you cheese grate, if I cheese grated my arm, you'd be fucking crazy. I'm doing that one. What? You see, I like this guy. Never said which way the tacks were facing. You could be getting off scot free here. Scott, red. <sighs> Would I rather talk in only an auto tuned voice? Or talk in a stereotypical grandma voice. Does this does this count for auto tune? Because I can talk like this all day, baby. I'm finishing the video like this. Oh, I forgot to click the answer. I gotta see people auto tune voice, hundred percent. Oh, you sounded magical. Would I rather have my stomach pulled out of my mouth or have a brain pulled out of your eyes? What in the shit? This is going south, bro. This might be our ender, ladies and gentlemen. Holy shit. I mean, I'm gonna go with the stomach out of my mouth because then at least I still have my eyes, and I'd rather lose one stomach than an eye and a brain, because if they pull your brain through your- This is nasty, man, that one. If people pick otherwise, they're crazy. 69% of people agree, 31% of people are fucking crazy. Well, all right, guys, I think that's gonna be it for the video. If you guys enjoyed this and want another one, maybe we'll do like a different site, or maybe I'll risk it for the biscuit and ask you guys on Twitter what you guys think for some questions, which always goes very south. But like I said, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to show it some love with a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it, dude. Subscribe to this channel if you guys are new, and that's all I got for you guys today. Hopefully, see you guys tomorrow with a new video. Have a good rest of your day. Thank you for watching, and uh, yeah, I'll see you in church. Goodbye. Ah. I go hard in the motherfucking paint, nigga. Let you stank it, nigga. What the fuck you like it, nigga? I won't die for this shit or what the fuck I say. Front yard, broad day, what the hell?